Hey folks, Rob here. Thought we'd take a look at this uh, one tactical, or one Tigress, I'm sorry. Uh, tactical gear holder. As you can see up top here, I have my stuff I carry every day. Now this is a prototype uh, rack, so I don't know that these are available yet, but on there is the one Tigress tactical vest and we're going to be doing a review on this and so stay tuned and we're going to take a look at this thing and uh, see what it's like hey folks rob here and we have another product from one tigress and guys this is something i didn't think i would ever have uh just because i just didn't think i'd ever have one but what we have here is the one tigress tactical vest yeah, you heard that right. Rob's going tactical. Anyway, they sent me this over to uh, try out for the channel. And uh, actually sent me two of them. This thing is amazingly well made. I actually, one of my co-workers served in the Marine Corps. And uh, he wanted one. Uh, because he said he missed his uh, vest from the Marine Corps. So, I hooked him up with one of these vests. And uh, he took it home. He's looked it over. He has fooled with it. He said he looked at every seam trying to find a, a bad seam. Um, something wrong with it. You know, at the price point, he said, you know, this is... Now, I'm not going to say this is as good as military gear. But he said, you know, this this is a very quality vest. This is not just not a cheap made vest. And so far, all the One Tigress products I've had have been good products. Now... You got all your different Molly attachments here. You got your drag handle. You got some Velcro here on the back. And this is padded. It's just padded all the way up. You got really nice shoulder straps. You got these little things, I guess, to you could hang some equipment, maybe a radio antenna, uh, however you want to run it. You got your adjustable shoulder straps. This thing is kind of mesh on the inside, so. You know, kind of dissipates sweat a little bit. Uh, you got your cummerbund here, I'd call it, which is uh, really made well. It's uh, fairly stiff and thick. Uh, this thing comes completely assembled, unassembled, I should say. And uh, for somebody who'd never owned a tactical vest, there was a little learning curve to put it together. But, uh, you know, this old hillbilly finally figured it out. Uh, on your front, you have a place for a placard. You also have your, you know, your uh, molly there. You have molly all down the front with Velcro. Now, the, the great thing about this is it's quick release. Over here, you got your pull handles, if you can see that. And you pull out. It might be not be as easy done, but you pull out on this strap and those slide apart. So you have a plastic buckle that slides inside this. And it has a latching mechanism. So when you push it in, it latches. You hear that latch? It latches solid. Uh, you also have your buckles up here at your shoulder strap. So you can uh, get out of it quick if you need to. Guys, this thing is well made. And I don't know if y'all have noticed or not. But I'm a little bit on the portly side. And I thought, they're going to send me this dang thing. And it ain't going to fit me. And... Uh, let me tell you, I couldn't be much bigger, but it does fit me. And I'm a big old boy, 350 plus, and this thing fit me. Uh, inside your front panels here, you got your places for your carrier, your plates, or your soft body armor, whatever you put in. That's really good Velcro closures. You have a strap across the bottom with the Velcro on that, and you also have an inner... Uh, nylon strap that you can sense your plates down with and then you close all this up and you've got your your plate carrier or your or your plates or your soft body armor whatever you are running listen to me talking tactical whatever you're running you tactical boys know what i'm talking about so anyway got a pocket up here so put stuff in it got a nice deep pocket and so we're gonna put this thing on and i'm gonna show you that it will fit a fat boy now does it fit me 
Probably like it would most guys. Probably not. You know, I'm a pretty fat boy. And fat boys typically ain't too tactical. But, old Rob is going to get tactical on this one. So, here it is going around me. And it does come all the way around. And locks down. Now, I don't know if you can tell. That does cover my vitals. Most of them, anyway. I guess if it hit me right there, I'd be uh, hurting. But that covers most of my vitals. And my belly, that's the most vital part. It don't cover that, but it'd take a... So, you got plenty of room. You got your... Covers my back. These side, side pockets. They come up good. I don't know if you put a soft... Uh, armor in there how well it would work but you know and then of course you got your quick detach you got quick detach here guys this uh these are these are under a hundred dollars i i think when i looked them up they were like 89 bucks uh guys this is some this is some good gear i mean i've never owned a tactical vest but i'm betting a lot of them ain't no better than this and my experience with one tigress is Everything they've sent me has been uh, pretty well top of the line for Chinese imported stuff. So, anyway, <laughs> Rob's gone tactical. Me and Bubba are going to get together and play Army, man. Bubba, you up for it? I challenge you, Bubba. We're going to get together. I got to get me one of them helmets like you got or whatever it is you wear when you got your tactical vest on. Huh? We're going to get together and play Soldier Boys. And roll around in the mud and go bang bang <laughs> anyway guys this is something you know might be practical to have around i don't know i'm gonna get me some molly gear might put me a chest holster right here make it easy to draw a gun you know uh could keep you from injuring yourself uh you know like i said i never thought i'd be wearing a tactical vest but i've gone tactical on you all and when the shit hits the fan Guess who's going to survive? Because I have a tactical vest. So I have the tactical advantage. Yeah. Anyway, guys. Uh, <laughs> you, you, the tactical advantage will end when my big fat ass takes off running and gets about 10 feet and strokes out. Anyway, guys, I appreciate you watching. Uh, I thank each and every one of you. Go check out the One Tigress gear. They got it in different colors. Uh, they're an awesome company. I swear, they just... They have blessed me so much with their products and, you know, uh, make some of these videos uh, uh, for me to do, you know. Uh, I can only buy so many guns and, you know, if I only shot videos with the guns I have, I'd, I wouldn't make very many videos. So anyway, these uh, guys keep me going and uh, I appreciate y'all. And until we next video, when we might be getting tactical, who knows? Bubba, I challenge you to a pew pew. <laughs> I'm going to be the good guy, or you want to be the good guy. Nah, it don't matter. Anyway, guys, thank you. Appreciate it. Have a good weekend.